YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I am coming back at you guys with another video. And today I'm going to share with you guys some of my top favorite nude lipsticks from NYX Cosmetics. So if you want to know what they are and you want to see how they look like, then keep on watching. <laughs> All right, so let's get started, guys. I'm so excited for this video because I love NYX Cosmetic Lip Products. They're so inexpensive and they're so easy accessible because you can find it anywhere. You can find it in Target. I believe they're in CVS. You can find it in Ulta. And they also have their own NYX Cosmetic store that you could also find everything. And that's where I usually buy all my NYX Cosmetic stuff is at the NYX store because they have everything. Um, and they have a online website as well so it's so accessible anybody could find a NYX product almost anywhere pretty much majority of my lip combos or my lipsticks from NYX are from the soft line the soft matte lip line which I love it's not too drying and it applies really soft almost like a cushion type feel to it they extended their soft matte lip line and they added a few new colors and I have a few of them right now and I'm so happy that they did because they added a few more new colors and I live for a nude honey. So the first one I want to mention is all from the soft matte lip cream line. Woo! tongue twister um, it's called Cape Town and I'm gonna cheat a little bit um, when I wear Cape Town I like to match it with my Milani lip liner in all natural number four and I literally bought this at um, CVS and this is like uh, I believe six dollars six or seven dollars so it's inexpensive well my definition this is this is inexpensive this is one of my favorite drugstore liner because I like putting it all over the lip and I sometimes I'll just go like that or wear a clear lip gloss on top. So this is how the lip liner looks like. Then I'll take Cape Town and I'll put it all over my lips so I'm doing that right now actually let me swatch Cape Town for you guys so this is how Cape Town looks like it's a really light color and then I'll just put it all over the place all over the lips okay and then that's how it's looking so far I could definitely go darker with a darker lip liner you guys definitely can but I like wearing it this color. I don't know why. It looks pretty. Especially if I have like this type of makeup on, I would definitely do this type of lip. I love it. And it started giving me like coral. It has like a nice coral undertone to it, you know? A lip liner I'm going to mention is Urban Cafe. And this is the lip liner I'm going to use for pretty much majority of the lip products. So this is called the Slide On Glide On Stay On and Definitely Turn You On Waterproof Extremely Color Lip Liner. And then in, in parentheses it says, this lip liner is so good, the name has to be this long. So um, it's really hard to find Urban Cafe, but when you guys do find it, get like four. It's really good and I believe it's only uh, $4.50. So good and it looks good on any nude. So if you are a woman of color, my skin tone, darker, this is definitely something that you would want in your collection. This is my favorite lip pencil from NYX Cosmetic, like ever, ever. I'm gonna line my lips with this lip liner. So this is how it's looking at with the lip liner. I love this lip liner, guys. Um, I am going to take the color London. And this is like a staple piece for everybody. I feel like everybody has London. This is such a pretty color and a pretty nude. So this is how it's looking like. This is London with the lip liner Urban Cafe. So this is how it's looking like guys. And this is how it's looking swatched. Okay, so another lip product I'm going to mention, and it doesn't really need a lip liner, are these two right here. 
and this is Toulouse and this one is Los Angeles and I love wearing these two these are like one of my everyday lipstick when I'm just going out the door and I just want to put something like you know give myself a little bit of color um, I know what you guys are thinking you're probably thinking hey these are really similar but I mean they are really similar but Toulouse is a little bit more purpley and um, Los Angeles is a little bit more of a gray brownie um, purple if that makes sense but I'm gonna wear the two so you guys can see the difference first I'm gonna um, try Toulouse which Toulouse is one of my favorite out of all of them Toulouse is my favorite and I normally wear it by itself so this is Toulouse it's so pretty and every time I see Toulouse honestly I buy like three or four like because I, to me the soft matte lip uh, lip cream they do not last long if there's a color and it's your favorite just get two or three for sure this is how Toulouse is swatched so this is how Toulouse is swatched such a pretty color such a pretty color the next one is um, Los Angeles which is similar um, like I said it's similar but it's a little bit more of a brownie type color I like wearing it by itself same as Toulouse so you see the difference this is more of a brown undertone and then Toulouse is completely purple so so this is how it is and then um, I still have this watch for Toulouse I'm gonna swatch Los Angeles together with it so let's see so this is Toulouse and this is Los Angeles see if you see the difference here this is a much more brighter than Los Angeles so um, definitely these two are something that I wear all the time when I'm out on the go because I don't need to wear a lip liner with them so these two are awesome Toulouse honestly is my favorite out of the two next lip combo I'm gonna mention is I'm debating which one I want to try this right here and this is in the color stable so this is how it looks like right here and literally um, I used to wear this all the time this is how it is swatch this is such a pretty color um, like I said I'm going in with urban cafe again then I'm gonna take stable which is such a pretty color it in then I'll go right back in with urban urban cafe again and kind of just realign everything this is it I hardly ever wear it this without a gloss and the gloss I usually wear with this lip combo is from, this is from the NYX glam lip gloss and awkward looks so this is it right here and this is in the color stone foxy so I like to top it off with this aqua luxe lip gloss is so underrated and hardly ever see anybody talk about these lip glosses i love them it has like nice gold um glitter on it if that makes sense it's so pretty and i love it and this looks really well with this makeup look guys like this is like my summer go-to like guys lip glosses are the way to go for this summer or this spring so this is how it swatches right here right next to stable so the next combination I'm going to mention obviously it's going to be the same lip liner but I'm going to mention um, from the same line which is the lipstick matte lipstick line and this is in butter 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 and this is not for the faint of hearts. Literally, you have to be really bold to wear this. This is something that I will definitely wear when I'm going out, when I want to make a statement. Like this is something that I know that I want to turn heads and I know that I'm going to be asked, what are you wearing on your lips? This is when I like to whip this baby out. Um, so I'm going to line my lips once again with Urban Cafe. Okay. Then I'm going to go in with butter, 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 butter. So this is how it's looking like so far and obviously I'll just go back in with Urban Cafe. Just to darken the outer part. 
so it could be wearable. This is how it's looking at so far and I love how this looks. Like sometimes I'll just leave it like this. I'll just leave it alone if I want a matte look. Or sometimes if I want to be a little extra and I want to be, you know, glossy mommy, I'll just put um, the intense butter gloss in cookie butter. So this is how it looks like right this is how it looks like right here. And then I'm gonna swatch it right next to um, the butter swatch that I did earlier. So this is how it's looking like right here. So these are the two. And then I'll just put that all over. This is it right here. So pretty guys. Like I love this lip color and I, I love to wear this like when I'm going to a concert or out with my girlfriends or something like that. And honestly, every time I wear it, I always get compliments. I will always ask me where, what lip color are you wearing? So if you guys are a little bit bolder and you don't mind experimenting with your lip colors, then definitely try this lip combination. Um, I love it. Love, 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 love it. <sighs> My lips are on fire, fire. Last but not least, this is a lip lipstick that I hardly ever see anybody talk about from NYX Cosmetic, their lip line is, and it's from their Full Throttle uh, lip uh, lip line, and this is how it looks like right here. I never ever see anybody talk about this. Um, I love this. This is like, this is a matte lipstick. Your lips ain't going nowhere when you wear this. Um, again, I like to pair it with my Milani um, All Natural lip liner just so I could have, just so I could have a base, you know. Guys, I love this lip liner. And then I'll put full throttle, and this is in the color Kiss the Dust. I love this nude. This is like, you know when you just find your perfect nude for yourself? So this is how it's watched right here. And I'm just gonna put it on. This is how it's looking like. Kiss the dust. Full throttle lipstick. It's a matte lipstick. I love it. When you apply it, it feels it's gliding right into your lips. And then it dries matte. So if you girls are interested in a matte lipstick, definitely try these. And let me just add some lip gloss, guys. BRB. Ooh, this looks pretty with this lip gloss as well. Alright, so that's pretty much it guys. So these are my favorite lippies from NYX Cosmetics minus the Milani lip liner. Sorry guys, but I just threw that in there. I have other colors of these um, full of these full throttle lipsticks. So if you want me to do a swatch of all the colors that I have in my collection, let me know in the comments down below. Um, another thing, if you guys like this makeup look that I did and you want a makeup tutorial, then thumb this video and leave a comment down below that you guys want to see this makeup tutorial. Yeah. Bye guys.